Are you serious? Are you serious? That's what Coach Javi does for a living. Whew. All right, so here's the uh, here's the lowdown for today. I deeply apologize because I didn't record Sunday League this weekend. One, we had the camp on Saturday. We didn't get back until pretty late Saturday night, so we were exhausted. So when I woke up in the morning, I was already running late as usual. I got there right when the game started. I didn't have time to set up the tripod because I didn't have anybody to record it this week. I was like, I'm tired, I'm exhausted. There's no way I'm just gonna be running around like crazy like I did last week. I'm gonna not do anything too crazy and I'm just gonna play. So, sorry, didn't get to record it. After reading the comments on that first one where I talk about should I retire or should I keep playing? And I was just, I, I was kind of messing around. I mean, especially when you're playing Sunday that you're kind of already retired anyway. But I've decided Coach Javi needs to practice what he preaches and I am going to start training again. What I've decided to do is I'm gonna start waking up early. I'm gonna go out for a jog, do a little bit of jump rope, and then maybe come out here and kick the soccer ball around a little bit. So we'll see how that goes or we'll see how long it lasts. Coach Javi's gonna get back into shape because check this out. That's as far as I can reach stretching wise. Like that's pushing it right there. We're gonna get back into it. So one thing that I wanna do, I'm gonna do a little skill challenge, a little move, something very, very simple. And then I want you guys to see if you guys can do it or if you guys can do it better than me, which probably 95% of you guys probably can and send it in to me. So I'm gonna record myself doing it. That's the skill challenge for the day, for the week, whatever. And then I want you guys to send it in to Coach Javi at hotmail.com. So you can send it through my email or you can send it through through Instagram, however you want to do that. Just make sure if you send it through Instagram, your profile is unlocked because if it's locked, um, I won't be able to see it. I'll post some of the clips at the beginning of, of the videos so you guys can be featured on the channel. So the first one's going to be a tough one. The first one's going to be a tough one. The first one I like to call the quad. I don't even know if I can do it. So the quad consists of four different things. You have to keep the ball in the air the entire time. The first one is outside. Second one, inside. Third one, around the world with the other leg. Fourth one, to complete the quad, is the little jump. Boom! And then, top bins. That went in. There's a little hole there, that went in. Can we get the instant replay, please? Top bins! Go ahead, get your videos recorded, however you want to get them sent, send them in, and I'll feature them on my channel. Let's do some jump rope, mate. Mate, why were you not at the camp? That's a good question, mate. I'm only coming for, um, you know, when we go to New York, LA, same with Tom. Look at that legend right there. 30 seconds of, uh, no, here's your I, advertisement. Th but this is bad. Like, I can need the YouTube camera channel? off and then... Do you have a YouTube no, channel? No, but I kind of want to make one. Like, you inspire me to make one. But I just don't know if anybody would watch my YouTube channel. So I guess I'll just ask, would anyone watch a goalkeeper's YouTube channel? There's my question. You guys can tell me if you want one. I'm pretty good, I promise. So what if I decide I want to start doing goalkeeper videos? You can't. You're not qualified as a goalkeeper mm, coach. Three years in high school. I don't know. So if anyone would like to learn more about goalkeepers 
or if any goalkeepers would like some, I don't know, YouTube. I like I get so stuttery on the camera. Stop. <laughs> if any goalkeepers would like a YouTube channel dedicated to them and drills, all kinds of like things that are goalkeeper specific, let me know and I can try and put that together. Listen, I'm not Coach Javi level. I will never be Coach Javi, but if I can offer some insight and help out some people, just let me know if that would be something of interest for all you goalkeepers out there. Where are all the cones and pennies? The cones and pennies? <laughs> Why do you have to do a close up? Yeah. Where, where the are they? Up in the locker room. No, they're not. We're Mate. missing. Man, they haven't found a lot of monster yet. Though. We're, missing, which, which ones are we we're missing? missing a thing of pennies and thin cones. You which were ones? the culprit last time. Which one? Coach Javi hoards the cones yeah, and pennies and he puts them in, he, the, he in his trunk. Otto, where are the cones <laughs> and the pennies? That's what I want to know. Look what, at is this. Is that your team? This is what's saying that. <laughs> this guy gives you lupus, huh? Hey, look, I'm, I'm telling you, the comment section is about to blow up with my Mexican peoples right here. Show them that. Gashami is saying... Eat it, eat it Gashami. Gashami is saying that this is... It's that not, this is crap. I don't know about this. I mean, you got to make up your mind. If you want it spicy, then have it spicy. If you want it sweet, then you have it sweet. I don't like the sweet and sour stuff. You know what I mean? Wait, hey, Brad, how the camp go? Good. From Brad. Yeah, the from camp was good. Camp was good. A lot of players out What's there. A lot of excitement. Name? The weather was perfect. The field was great. Yeah, yeah it was fun. I think I think that's the best thing about it. It was it was legitimate fun. Everybody was having a good time, so I enjoyed it. Yeah, I don't know. Where were you, mate? Yeah, I mean, that's what, that's what happens. People have fun, but when Gashami's there, it's quality. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> just add that to the game. <laughs> if Gashami ran this camp like his club trainings, he'd show up for the first 30 minutes, talk to the team, you know, have them around in a circle, talk, and then they get done 15 minutes early. Like so coach. I'm not sure what... <laughs> hey, Coach Javi, tell him about my team. Tell him. Tell him. What do you think about my team? Um... Which team? I think they're the most overhyped, overrated group that I've ever seen. <laughs> Dang, coming from the head coach. I mean, from uh, the head coach. Still crap candy, though. <laughs> <laughs>update we had easter break so isak was uh was gone for easter break i had the camp we had a lot of other things going on but we are back at it my friends back at it again as you can see over there coach javi has already set up the session today we're going to focus on some technical work and some some sprints so we're going to incorporate uh, some exercise that have some longer distance sprints um where he can reach his uh his top sprint speed yeah and then a little update on the coca-cola standings i think we got i don't even remember I think you're up by, three. you're up by like two or three, yeah, yeah. but Coach Javi's going to make an effort to come back. We'll see how it goes. All right, back at it again, my friends. We should still have fun, though we say we don't. It's I just want to get done with you, 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 you. Yeah. For the last time, I can call you mine. Once more then I swear we are through We should still have fun Though we say we don't I just wanna get done
This and stuff is so terrible. <laughs> I was eating it like oh, like surely one of these is like voice. sugar. Like sure, one is just normal candy, right? What Bro. did you say? Bo -bo -bo you don't like it? What is popo? Oh. Let me see. What do you got? I have there? a taste of this. What do hot, you got there? Hot and salted tamarind pulp candy. All right, hold on. I gotta show the people because. <laughs> all right, so <laughs> my Mexican people are going to back me up on this for sure. Okay. We got these bad boys right here. We got the mazapanes right there. I don't terrible. know what those are called. Are They're all tamarindo, mate. And then we got the Pelon Rico. People know about this right here. People know about what this right here, mean? mate. Hair? Doesn't that mean hair? No. What is And then the... What does that mean? <laughs> uh, Brad says that it's all terrible and he doesn't like it. Mate, I'm just looking for... Is where, where's one saying? that, like, legit can't... Like, this is not candy, honestly. The tea... Look, doesn't look like it so package. much either. Is this I, I don't is mind moldy? the lollipop. This is okay. Is that moldy? No, that's not moldy. What, what is Mate, that? What is that's that? the powder so that it doesn't stick. <laughs> like, you know when they do that with bread when they're baking? They put like the, guess, the powder yeah. on there so it doesn't so, stick together. This one, it smell, this Hold on, no, 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 no. You're doing it completely wrong. Okay, how do I And how the do people I do? know this. You the have people, to be extremely careful because that will fall apart. The people know this. That will fall apart. Okay, how do I do it? You have to very, very slowly pull apart the the plastic there. Like, like very delicately. Now you got it okay, without, okay, okay, without okay. it cracking. Okay. Well, for the most well, part. For the most and now you just eat it in pieces. In pieces. Okay. So now you can crack it into little bits. <gasps> see what I mean? Oh. Man, you are having a You can nightmare. have that. Oh, that's good. What is that? Masapan, mate. That's so good. Okay, Brad, this is pretty good. Yo, Brad, this is your last chance at redemption in front of my Mexican people. This is actually pretty good. You're about to get voted off this channel, mate. <laughs> it's actually sweet. Yeah, that's it's candy. Like cookie dough. That's a peanut butter candy. Do you guys have peanut butter in Mexico? <laughs> no, seriously, mate, they don't. You, oh my no, goodness, mate. Listen, okay. because they don't Jesus. have it. They don't have it like Jesus. most hey, I was places. About, I was about Congratulations, to Costa Rica. I was about listen, to get to the uh, oh my God. <laughs> hey, you hold, guys can you guys can my, both uh, hold my you guys can both say goodbye to the channel. <laughs> no. Tell the people goodbye that they won't ever see you again. All right, Brad. Okay. Get to end it, mate. Any any final? Uh, uh, keep in mind that I know my Mexican people will back me on this. So anything else you have to say to to you know to maintain your reputation on my channel? Have we decided where the next camp is? Yes. There's another camp coming up. That's good. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm roasted. <laughs> At this point, we're not sure if you're, you made the list of coaches attending this this next camp, mate. Yeah, just don't use any of that last stuff. Just wouldn't use any of that last. Wait, I can't. I can't do that. Footage. Yeah, you are a purist in the vlogging world. Yep. All right. Well, that's it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. Comment down below if you want Brad to stay on this channel. Also, comment down below if you want his mixtape to be released to the public because it is in the works. People think we're kidding. They want to. They want to edit. They want a taste of it. Give him a taste, Brad. Give him a taste to end this video, man. They want give a taste of it. Give him a taste to end this now, video. Now this is just a quick, quick edit. Right here. Hey. Flow so fresh. <laughs> you, say you say you were flipping quesadillas in that flipping last one? Flipping quesadillas so they're brown on each side. Got the cheese in the middle. I don't know, man. Flow so fresh. It's like produce on a stand. Wow. Just let that marinate for a little bit.